Two new developments surrounding an Oklahoma lawmaker who's getting worldwide attention in relation to the next Benedict story. We told you the student identified as non-binary. This story involves State Senator Tom Woods, who is from the Stillwell area during a public event where he referred to the LGBT community as filth. Just this afternoon, the top Republican in the state Senate said Woods' remarks were reprehensible and inappropriate. For his part, Woods released a statement and did not apologize. First, we'll let you listen to the audio recorded by the Tahlequah Daily Press so you'll get the full context. My heart goes out to that scenario if, uh, if that is the case. But we represent a constituency. Uh, we're a, a Republican state, super majority in the House and Senate. I represent a constituency that doesn't want that filth in Oklahoma. You know, we are a religious state. Uh, we're going, we are going to fight to keep that filth out of the state of Oklahoma because we're a Christian state. Uh, we're a moral state. We want lower taxes. We want people to be able to live and work and 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 be. Go to the faith they choose. Woods released a statement saying a child losing their life is horrible and bullying is never okay. He went on to say, quote, I want to say that I stand behind what I believe in. He went on to say the groups and individuals who push gender reassignment on our children in schools and anyone else who is trying to normalize behavior that shouldn't be tolerated is unacceptable in my mind. Republican Senate pro tem Greg Treat said he talked to Woods about his comments. Senator Woods and I quote have, have spoken and I made it clear that his remarks were reprehensible and inappropriate. He went on to say in my opinion he had a serious lapse of judgment and it has distracted from the mission and good work we are attempting to advance on behalf of all Oklahomans. Now tonight, Fox 23 talked with state Democrat representative John Waldron, who responded to Woods' statements saying that everyone needs to take a step back and cool down their rhetoric. I think language like that is very dangerous and has a deep and dark history in our country and around the world. We ought to be much more careful in our use of speech. Uh, and we should never use a term like filth when we're referring to citizens of Oklahoma. Now, to read all of the lawmakers' full statements on this topic, go to fox23.com and search for this story.